Hey guys, hey, this is Diddy C7, and uh, today I'm going to be showing you uh, a tutorial of how to install the, um, the Technic Pack mod pack. And all the first thing you need to do is get a fresh 1.7.3 um, Minecraft folder or a bin. Uh, next thing you need to do is go in here, or the next thing you need to do is go to this page and download the mod pack. Just click this one. Um, and when that's done, that may take a while because it's a lot of memory, then you just open this with WinRAR, which is the Minecraft folder. Uh, then you go to your downloads, and then you open this with WinRAR. Um, the reason why you should use WinRAR is because I'll show you. If you open it with WinZip, it looks very, very unhelpful. You see, you got this, and then you got that. And I tried doing it with WinZip, and I couldn't do it. So use use this one, use WinZip. So the first thing you need to do is go into Jar and go into Armor. At least this is how I did it, and it went perfectly. Just copy all that and paste it in there, or drag it, drag it and drop. So then you can delete that. And then you go into your pulse code, go into sound, go to codex, and do the same here. You need to find pulse. Okay, first of all, you need to delete meta if, of course. Most of you already know that, but still. Pulse code, sound, codex. You take that one and drag it over there. Now that is done, you can go out and you can delete pulse code. And then it's just title, go into title here, and take splashes and drag it over there, and then you just delete that, then take, click there, and press shift and click here, of course you need to do this first, and then you just drag and drop everything over here, this may take a while since it's a lot of files, and uh, boom, there you go. Now, then you can just close this. You can also go to the top here, go back and go to your directory. Um, and then you go out of your bin and go back here. Um, then you go and copy all of this. Oh, God. Like that drag it and drop it. There's no more to it than that. Um, I shall also get the... Well, that is loading. I should get the... Oh, shit. Yeah, that one. I will get one other mod for you. Um, documents. There. And uh, too many items. So that will prove that it works. Then I have to go into bin again, of course. Thank God, I'm so dumb. Still, uh, you do that, and many of you already know this, but you just drag and drop. Okay, now uh, that's installed. And then you can just close everything up and uh, fire up a Minecraft. And um, let's see, An update is available, you just click not now. Because it's 1.7.3, you don't want to update it to 1.1 1 .1 day. 1.1, no, 1.8.1. And uh, look, no black screen. I'm just gonna change this view setting like that. And oh, that was wrong. Also need to change that. That controls. Yeah, anyways, I can change that later. Yeah, I need to change my way to settings back. There, uh, done, done. Single player, create new world. Just create it. <coughs> and you'll see, it will take some time to load. Because it had to load in all the new features of the mods. And, well, it usually stops there for me, but still, it went further on this time. And here you go, spawned right next to a 
NPC village. This is very nice. Uh, there you go. You see the millionaire, and uh, press E. You can see the red power or the red yeah the red power mod. It is actually working, but not so. You can see this. It's actually from the red power mod, but it's not working so well with um, TMI or too many items so just to make sure you know it's working just I'll just take that and the workbench like that and uh, see there you go red alloy allo wire alloy yeah alloy and that is the one of these I don't know where but it's one of these so just keep that in mind. And that was it for this tutorial, guys. Thanks for watching, and if this really helped you, uh, leave a like or a thumbs up, and um, see you later. Bye.